Good morning, Mackenzie. And yes, yesterday we had yet another presidential candidate, Pete Buttigieg, make their way through Iowa City to greet people downtown. Pete Buttigieg, mayor of South Bend, Indiana, and now a presidential candidate for the 2020 election, visited Iowa City yesterday afternoon. The airliner was crowded once again with students and community members to hear Buttigieg's reason and platform for running for president. Uh, I find everywhere I go, people are sometimes, especially here in Iowa, uh, a little too polite uh, to ask the question of why a 37-year-old mayor thinks he has any business uh, being in a discussion about the highest office in the land. And so I, I just want to point out why this is a season for something completely different when it comes to leadership in this country. Uh, I understand that we're accustomed to seeing people who have uh, marinated in Washington for a long time. Uh, they were accustomed to seeing people maybe with a different background uh, than local government. But I would argue that if we got Washington to look more like our best run cities and towns instead of the other way around, this would be a better country to live in. And when asked why the student vote is important to him, he had this to say. So I think we really need young people to uh, lift their voices and be heard. You know, no great change has come to this country without a lot of leadership from young people. And the young people who saw him speak yesterday thought his message was appealing. Pete being such a young person and not necessarily directly involved in like federal politics, it appeals to me because he's a little bit of an outside view. He's still a politician, which I believe is important. You need to know how government and policy works. For now, Buttigieg is the youngest Democratic candidate for president, the only one who considers himself a millennial, which overall could make him more engaging for pressing issues of this generation. Some more on Buttigieg is that he is the only openly gay Democratic candidate and that he is an Afghanistan war veteran. He attended Harvard College and he is in his eighth and final year as the mayor of South Bend, Indiana. Buttigieg now joins 14 other Democratic candidates on the race to the 2020 presidential election. John McKenzie, back to you.